Okay, so we'll set him up for an insulation test to get to pi and dar. First button is pi, second button is dar. Um, but we'll do a pi test on this. It then sets the time clock up there on the top right. So the jacks you use for the insulation test are this separate one here and then the standard ohms volts input terminal. Um, this doesn't lock on even though I've selected pi and dar. Um, let's put the light on so we can see. So you can see we set up pi, 10 minutes, 250 volts. Um, so to get it to lock on, I'll have to hit the lock button, press the test button, and then it will start away. So we'll leave that to go through to the 10 minutes, and you'll see what the result it gives, because that is quite interesting. So we'll let him run, it's coming up to one minute now. We'll need to remember that value. Okay, we're coming up to the end of the pi test. Now this pi on this should be around about 7.62, but as you can see, it's only showing five on this meter. The manual says that it should show a greater than five symbol in circumstances like this when it goes to five, because for whatever reason they've limited polarization index value to a maximum of five um, but as you can see this unit doesn't display that uh, we'll go back through the one minute and the 10 minute values in post edit and you'll see that the actual ratio would be much greater than five but there seems to be a limitation and what you also find as well with this instrument now that I've done pi dar I can't get back to any of the other test values a lot of meters will let you page back through the one minute and the 10 minute uh, insulation readings and then the actual index value but this meter uh, doesn't let you do that yeah, what do you see a select button doesn't work on anything range doesn't do anything um, compare doesn't do anything pi dar just changes it between pi and the dar um, record that hopefully doesn't do anything hold will just take you off lock and pressing the test button again just starts up another test so it's uh, a bit disappointing that you can't get back to those resistance values because they're just as equally as important as the actual DAR or PI ratio and, that, and the DAR facility works in exactly the same manner uh, except I'm not aware of a limit on that ratio um, it comes back as 1.6 on this box and that works fine yeah that's the end of the uh, insulation testing demo